and he's already British champion. Mitch Price reports. At the Birmingham Wheels track, just a mile from the city centre, the new British Speedway champion prepares for his latest challenge. On Sunday, he rides in the overseas final of the World Speedway Championship in Coventry. A crushed bone in his back, just a minor inconvenience. The Brandon Stadium will bring back happy memories for Neil Evitts, who earlier this month won the British title there. Inspired, he says, by the tragic death of his teammate Kenny Carter. For although Evitts lives in Dudley, he travels 100 miles every home match to ride for Bradford. I used to ride for Birmingham in the first division, and when they closed before the start of the season, I had no choice but to join Halifax. I wasn't very happy with having to go all that way for my home meetings, but after spending the one year there, I was very happy with the way things went. I liked the people there and the management, so I decided to stay again, and obviously I'm here again for the third year. It's been a hell of a season for you so far. Oh, this season for me is just, it's just, I just can't believe it. I uh, won the British final and I had to, I woke up five o'clock the next morning and went downstairs and looked at the trophy just to believe that it was mine and I was British champion. Now, you're a Dudley lad, you've got a good black country accent there. <laughs> Any chance of you riding for your local team Cradley at some point? <laughs> country, do you think? I don't think so. I've never been approached by uh, Cradley and um, I just don't really see any uh, real chance of that ever happening. But at the moment, you're just happy to be picking up the points for Bradford. It's, that's right. Nevertheless, Evitz remains a local lad at heart, with his parents staunch supporters of their son's often dangerous sporting exploits. With Neil's elder brother Paul riding for Birmingham, yeah. and Father Tom a promoter until recently, Speedway races freely through the Evitz family blood. When he was a, a, a small boy, we used to go round to Cradley on a Saturday night. We used to take them both with us. And it used to be our Saturday night out. And we didn't have to have a babysitter. And they didn't have to sit still and be good. And we just got involved from there. And he just loves Speedway. No, I, mean, I think a lot of people tend to think that a Speedway rider turns up at uh, 6 o'clock on a race night, does four races, and that's it till the next one. Well, you know, that's not the case because he's up at uh, quite early in the morning, spends most days in his workshop, stripping a bike completely and rebuilding it for the next meeting. Two recent crashes have done little to quell Evitt's thirst for success. On Sunday, he'll be strapping on a special support for his injured back in his quest to reach his first World Championship final. Well, I'd obviously like to win the British final a few more times. I want to reach the World Final this year. This is the first year which I've really thought about that I can do it, and uh, as long as I don't have any major disaster, I don't see any reason why I shouldn't. But for one young woman, it was uh, 